The topic is Maxwell's curl equation for static electric field. Here we consider an electric field due to point charge that is static. Here the electric field is originated from this point charge Q and terminate to infinity in all the three directions. And in this three dimensional space where the electric field is E vector, we have to move a test charge from point B to point A. So there is a potential difference between point A and B, which is given by this formula that is potential difference V equals to minus integration E dot dl. The limits are from B to A because we are moving from point B to A. And as we know that the potential is independent of path followed from B to A. So as we make as many as paths from B to A, the potential difference is same. It is independent of the path. So here we consider a two paths. First path is B D A and second is B C A. While moving on these two paths, the potential difference between point A and B is same. So the potential difference while moving from point B C A and B D A is equal. So we take this the potential difference for point for path B C A and for path B D A. Now we move point uh, integration B D A to the left side. It become positive and the path for path B C A with negative sign we can write it as opposite path that is A C B with positive sign. So from here these two integration makes a closed path that is B D A integration plus A C B integration. So there is a common point A. So it makes a closed path that is B D A C B. So here we get a closed integration of E dot D L around a closed path that is from B D A C B and that is equals to 0. Means the closed line integral of E dot D L is equals to 0. So this is a equation of potential difference in a closed path. In a closed path as we move in a closed path the potential difference between two points is equals to 0. So we conclude that the line integral of electric intensity E over a closed path equal to 0 for any static charge distribution. And here the closed line integration of E dot DL is equals to 0 which tells us that the given field that is electric field is conservative field. So the conservative fields are those fields whose line integration over a closed path is equals to 0. Now this is a Closed line integration of E dot DL that is equals to 0. Here we multiply both sides by a test charge Q. Sm small q. Now, after multiplying by a test charge on both sides, left side we get Q into E. And what is Q into E vector? That is force. So here we get a line integration of f dot dl. So f dot dl over a closed line integration is the work done by moving a test charge q in a closed path and it is always equals to 
zero, which means that the work involved in moving a test charge around a closed path in static electric field is equal to zero. So the field which satisfy these two conditions are called conservative fields. So force field and electric field intensity is conservative field. Okay. Now we talk about Maxwell's curl equation. So for that we have to require a curl of a vector. What is curl of a vector? For a curl of a vector we define closed path and we know that a closed path define open surface. So this open surface has some surface area delta s and we move in a closed path between two points A and B. So according to definition of curl of a vector that is del cross E which says that maximum circulation of vector E around a closed path that is closed line integration E dot DL per unit surface area that is delta S as delta S tends to 0. This curl of a vector having a direction that is normal direction. So this is definition of curl of a vector. Curl of a vector E is equals to line integration, closed line integration E dot DL upon delta S as, as delta S tends to 0. We get a maximum circulation and having a direction that is normal direction. So while applying this the condition of closed line integration E dot DL that is equals to 0 in curl of a vector, we find that curl of E that is del cross E vector is equals to 0 and this is called a Maxwell's curl equation for static fields. So the Maxwell's curl, Maxwell's curl equation is del cross E is equals to 0 and this is for any path. That path should be closed one between two points. So the field, here the field is electric field intensity E, the field whose curl is 0 are called irrotational fields. So this is about a Maxwell's curl equation for static electric field.